Welcome back to the Shroob Factory in the middle of the Shroob Forest in a Shroobtastic day. Shroob. And look at all, and to your right you find you'll find a whole bunch of toad spirits. Oh, oh my god, god. Right, that's their life force. That is. Yeah, they look oh, like... I never realized that. Yeah, yeah, that is outright just their that is like some freaking nine. That is their ghosts. I was about to say, like the you say you say spirits, you say ghosts. For a very split second, I almost mistook them for sperm. <laughs> well, I mean, in some cases, you. Could, and I mean, you make. I mean, te te backing up, te backing up. Technically, the life force of the life force of mushrooms is are their spores, which are essentially mushroom sperm. Essentially. You're, you're usually the one who gets mad at us for making jokes like that, Steve. So. Yeah. But I'm okay with that one because that's a scientifically accurate show. Anyway. Hey, we. <laughs> yeah, Mario. I don't, learned don't. a lot in one, one day that I've ever learned in my entire life. Damn. Your wife? You're married? No, why? He's using a baby list. I'm making a, I'm making a joke. joke. <laughs> so, but Oops. yeah, with all of the, uh, yeah, no, freaking, that's, that is like some nine from like, you know, that old Tim Burton published movie. Yeah. This I, whole like machine stealing life force stuff. That, that yeah. movie is all right. It wasn't bad. Yeah. The movie, it the it movie, was it was intriguing ahead. in its concept, but I think it could have been a little bit more than what it was. I, I feel argue like it was a little bit too. The to keep in mind, it's been years since I've seen it, but from what I've seen, I feel like it didn't do enough world building. I think uh, it's this odd thing where I think someone I think someone already had a whole review talking about this, but I feel like the short, the little short animated movie actually get, does kind of a better job with its story or at least you know or yeah. conveying it i guess yeah so of all things for that movie nine there was a whole thing die <laughs> we're gonna we're gonna meet these dr troop guys he's dead <laughs> all in one I've got, I've got already... wait 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 but are they voiced are they voiced like the viruses <laughs> oh, that was so weird oh nice <laughs> oh yeah just to, oh, yeah. Yeah. Just to I... give you a I love yes. how the yellow and red voices fit, but then they just out of nowhere decide to make the blue one British. But yeah, just to get no, people... they just, no, they they try to they they just basically they basically just made blue the the stereotypical pretty boy in an anime. To give oh. pe to give people ahead, context, at the time of recording, they announced Doctor Mario World, and that had like a voice acted trailer. And from what I've been told, it's apparently the single worst bit of voice acting to ever exist. No, uh, I, haven't, I, haven't, I haven't seen it's it yet. It's not the word. I, 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 I don't think it's bad voice acting. I genuinely think it's hilarious. Yeah, no, I, like, I'm it's genuinely curious now. It is. Basically, oh yeah, we'll show you later. Wait, just it's, to let, it, it's it's fun and how boring it sounds. Yeah. Just to let you know, <laughs> it is not the worst bit of voice acting because at least it sounds like they have some bit of effort into it. Unlike some games, Phoenix games. <laughs> Yeah. So yeah. So what's happening there? What happens? What happens? Uh, what's happening there, Gui, is that they made a a. They're making a Super Mario. They're making a Doctor Mario mobile game, like you know, the kind with the yeah. premium currency. It, it's basically gonna be their. It's basically gonna be their Candy Crush. Yeah, and I did notice that. I and just didn't, I just and didn't know that there was a fully acted voice. A fully voice a, acted the, the, trailer. The, well, aside, uh, act, uh, acting is a stretch. Go ahead, James. Well, aside aside from the aside from the um. More star acting that trailer provided also gave us an interesting. Well, let's just say that everyone's a doctor now. Yeah, like, they're Bowser. making that canon now. Yeah, even Bowser. The, and Yoshi. They all have their own special. They all have their own <laughs> special abilities and stuff. So uh, calling Yoshi, just... honestly, calling Yoshi a doctor is a stretch. He feels he, he, he's, he looks like a straight up Doberman of a doctor. So <laughs> pay attention. If they eat the red mushroom, they'll go big. Yeah. Uh -oh. Ow. And hit oh, damn. They that mushroom. Oh, Ooh, boy. they get sick. sick. Yeah, makes them shrink. Oh, but I, my hammer can't hit him. Wow. So, duly noted. Well, well Luigi, for, for you, it doesn't look like it's hammer time. Well, I don't think I, I don't think I'd explain this not already. But if the, you start off with the health bars of the older Mario Brothers, if at any point Luigi or Mario were to take enough hits to be KO'd, then the baby Mario or baby Luigi will be left, which is fine enough, except they have to carry if the you bigger do, bros. Well, that's the thing. No. If you don't, if, no, no, hang on. They attack first, and all, if, they attack first and everything. But if you don't revive, uh, if you don't revive a Luigi, the, the older Luigi, older Mario in time, then when it comes time, when it comes time to do these jumping dodges, yes, 
Mario and Lu Baby Luigi, Baby Mario, and Baby Luigi have to like carry the older one to try and jump in the like. I thought they, they just, have a lot. They wait, have a lot. Well, hold on. I thought they. I thought they just pulled them backstage. Wait, do they? No, I I'm pretty sure they. I'm like, pretty sure they did. Like when 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 the older brother gets KO'd, the brother just um, Baby Mario, for example, pulls Mar Mario back, and then after that, he comes right back in the uh, battle. Oh, you battle know what? Now. You know. Oh, you know what I was mistaking it for? I was mistaking it for in the original Superstar Saga where Mario had to pick up Luigi and try and dodge stuff. with any game aside from Partners in Time, because I know Bowser's Inside Story did that too. Mm hmm. But that was because you didn't. Yeah, because that was still Mario and Luigi, not all the. Yeah, that's fair. That's fair. They had an excuse to get rid of it for this game, but every other game since, yeah, they, ha they had to keep that bit of dumbassery in, because I never understood that mechanic in the slightest. They're already KO'd. Come on, come on. Oh, there's a little bit of cooldown. Well, the battle the... doesn't end oh. until they're both oh, wow. KO'd, and you know what? Nice. You gotta make sure that one of the brothers Piggy doesn't back. get more KO'd. Man, jump, baby, jump. <laughs> Hit. Hit high block. High block. Oh, yeah. Joy. Joy. <laughs> Very I just, love... language. I just love the uh, the way they differentiate the two. It's like man, jump. Baby, jump. Yeah. <laughs> nah, I'm just imagining them all reading this together. So. I was gonna say something else and I forgot. Oh, something well, about the fact that Yoshi's literally was Yoshi's it literally oh, was it about Dr. Doberman now. Yeah, it was about Dr. Mario World. Oh yeah, I was gonna make a. It was it was just gonna be like a a little joke from me, like. What's up? Like oh boy, I finally got my teeth my my doctor's license. It only took me two weeks, but I finally got it. No. <laughs> the, the the doctor system in the Mushroom Kingdom. And, me, is very and meanwhile, Mario's like. They said I can never teach a Yoshi how to practice medicine. <laughs> and Luigi's there. Go and Luigi's there's going. And Luigi's there going. It took me two years. <laughs> it, uh, and Bowser's to be, like. To be fair, it took me decades, but I couldn't. I didn't get my license until my own year. And meanwhile, Bowser's <laughs> like, "Is that hard? I just thought it was a multiple choice question." <laughs> really? I, really? I just stole mine. <laughs> what are you guys That's doing? Doctor Page, I mean Doctor Bowser, at your service. You know what? It would be a sad day in the mushroom medical field if it got to a point where even Wario can pass off as a doctor. Oh, God, oh just no. wait. I'm will. I'm willing to bet they'll they'll get they'll make it. Well, actually, now that I think about it, no, Doctor Wario is already a thing uh, in WarioWare. That's gonna be a thing. I'm saying oh. that I'm I'm baffled. Okay, you know they're probably they're trying to get all the first per, trying to get all the first party characters out of the way first. They better at some point have a DLC which has you know Doctor E. Gad. <laughs> I'm sure that I would, would be amusing. Would be interesting. Maybe I mean, maybe already really set to coincide with um, Luigi's Mansion Three, or um, yeah. I mean, honestly, honestly, the potentials are limitless for like who they can make doctors now. Like, imagine a Doctor DK. Oh God, no! <laughs> oh, God. You know what? You say that. I'm just reminded of in one of the episodes of the cartoon when they're trying to convince Carol that the Crystal Coconut's cursed. There's a second where it's like he's showing Carol like this forged x-ray and he's actually dressed up in a Dr. Mario outfit. Yeah, I saw I, I saw that screenshot too. It's fucking stupid. <laughs> well, I'm just well, I'm just saying James, you're saying that it'll be Dr. D came in. Heck, what do you think the D stood What do you think the D stood for? Dr. <laughs> Dr. Kong. Dr. <laughs> Kong. I'm surprised That's there's never nice. been a Dr. Kong throughout wow. the entire I just throughout, <laughs> throughout the entire history of the Donkey Kong Country series. You I can... don't know why that was so silly to me, but, like, you're supposed to hit those with both brothers, but I literally just proved that with Mario, you don't even need Luigi to, like, hit those blocks. It's nothing. Really? Okay. I'm useful. I <laughs> There we go. Hey. So with that said, we finally made it to the end of this whole What's thing. Up? Place. Oh, no, I, I, was, I was only going to say, like, to make, to make Luigi feel included, whenever I play one of these games, I always make sure he gets some of the blocks. Yeah, well, that's fair. Everyone does. And we're about to figure out what the heck all of this vim, all of this mushroom life force has been it's used for. It's literally feeding this ra this random alien. It's feeding. Uh, Wiggler. Wiggler. It's feeding. Do it's feeding Mr. Mind. You almost Whoa. called him Doctor Mind. Shut up. I remember. I'm concerned anyway. with the hearts that pop out when they suck through his suck. Oh my! It likes all. It likes getting nice. They like getting nice and powered. But basically, this. Is what the Vim is being Ow. used for. It powers the their saucers. It's oh, no. Wait, Mario, no! I'm gonna smash it. No, Mario! Ah. Uh oh. Oh, it's tanked. Devil damn it! Oh. Me? It needs its constant like coffee. Look at, baby, baby Mario, look at all the spirits you've crushed. You know what? Welcome to like, our chapter, boss. That's just real quick. I'm not quite sure if anyone heard me, but I thought that was like an amusing moment of like where Mario is like cursing himself out. It's like devil damn it, me. <laughs> <laughs> It's like, I, I don't know if I should really insult myself. 
So yeah, it's Careful. never you, you, it's never a Mario and Luigi game without at least one Wiggler boss. So what we need to do is note what mushrooms are being held by the enemies and its drink. Yes. We want to make sure that we hit the ones with the poison mushrooms that we end up poisoning that dude's drink. Oh, do not I hit. See. Do not. Do not attack a Dr. Shroob if it has a red mushroom. That will heal the boss if it drinks that. Oh. So now we can deal much more damage to this thing, and it will not be able to attack for a few turns. And so that's why we're going to try to uh, keep a pattern going of always at least keeping its string poisoned at all times. Right. There Meanwhile, we go. There we go. Meanwhile, that's pretty, much, that's pretty much our main strategy. Then just keep an eye out for all of its attacks, and let's try out the old cannonballer. Oh boy. Which is perfect for things like bosses, where you need to... Donk. You're going to be launched Donk. up in the air with a cannon, Donk. and all four Donk. brothers at once deal a bunch of attacks, so you have to pay attention to, on the top screen, you have to pay attention to how far... to uh, The order uh, that which they're brought down. Yeah, which brother is down. going down first. Let's try it out. Here we go! This makes me think of the, the barrel cannons in Bowser's Inside Story. Well, that's Mario basically Luigi, what this Mario, is. Mario, Mario, Luigi, Luigi. Luigi. Hey, X, Y, ow. Oop. Messed up. Wow, you suck. <laughs> Still did a lot of damage. <laughs> oh, Try no. Just... He's gonna Whoa! get me. He's, He's gonna... Oh, oh, I shouldn't oh, have oh, 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 no, I shouldn't have drunk that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he drinks before any action, so keep that in mind. Well, he told oh, me shoot. I had a drinking problem, but I never believed him. Except now we have an issue, which is wait. Yeah. Except now we have an. There we go. Uh, except oh, now we have an issue, which is that I don't want to hit that guy. Well then, well then, worry, well, then worry about the wiggler. Yeah, worry about the wiggler. Right, but I'm just saying like that. I'm just saying that's the issue. Don't fuck up I'll, this I'll, time. I was just saying that's the issue. Mario, Luigi, Luigi, Mario. Yeah, so X, B, Y, There you go. I was waiting for somebody to do that. Let's just do it again. But I'm saying that's the issue is that you have to be careful that. Well, I'm saying I have to be careful because I know that the wig was going to get a turn to attack now because I can't keep it stun locked right now. Um, da, da, da. I don't know if this is too early to ask, but does this game, kind of like the other Mario and Luigi games, have one, oh. have like bro items that only certain brothers can utilize? Not that I recall. Nope. They all, nope, they all can use the same power ups. Uh oh. Okay. Luigi. Oh. Black. Oh. Black. Keep an eye. Keep an eye on which, uh, because they'll swap as you see. Remember which saucer is suiting first, and that's about it. Okay. Honestly, when it comes and to stuff like that, it's always just better off to, you're always better off just jumping with both brothers and hoping for the best. Yeah. That is because, also true. Then, because hammering air just works. Well, it, it scatters them, scatters them elsewhere. Yeah, it's like, it's like a fan. Kind of. <laughs> kind of. A very thick fan. Gosh really? dang, he's gonna get another turn. The world's thickest fan. Okay. <laughs> um, I'm trying to cool down the room, but that's gonna be thick. For a second. <sighs> Otherwise, I mean, um, what do you guys think of Wiggler as a character? I don't know why I'm now bringing this conversation up now. There we go. It's a Wiggler. But when they're not, well, alien, alien little toad suckers. I like the Wiggler in Super Mario 64. That was a fun one. Oh, right. they're you know they're they're literally taking energy from its from its ass. Yes, pretty much. <laughs> yeah, that that's why I was making the reference earlier. Good Oop. fiber. Well, not reference, but observation. Good fiber. <laughs> it's fibers found in wait, wait. and fiber is found in plants. It's astergy. Oh no. That's a stretch, dude. Shut up. It could work. <laughs> I'm trying to figure out. Oh my gosh! Fun, stop but I attacking can't. me. It's not working. That, you know that what? kind of joke only works okay, in you know what? astrology class. Actually, wow. what I was about there to we go. what I was about to say, if you don't mind bearing with me, is that you could say that like you could say that Wiggler is giving the troops some assistance. <laughs> there you go. Yes. yes! <laughs> Thank you, everybody. Join us next time on a great new adventure. Of, okay, please get poisoned. We are above twenty. All of us. Every last. Damn, one of us one is going to be 30 soon. Yeah. Multiples yeah. of us at I'm... some point. <laughs> okay, you're going to kill Let's it. What? What's my birthday again? It's in July. I, I forget the specific day. I just know it's in July. I know. I'm no, looking at my calendar to see Boy, how many weeks left. Boy, would it have sucked if you accidentally used the cannonballer on that one shrew genius. Yeah. Yes, it room. would. Do, 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 and do. that should be enough damage to take it out, I think. There, there yep, that's you it. go. Yeah. And now Woo! the shrews don't have any more power for the for their UFOs. Wait, wait, wait. They should be up I, well, right? I apologize, by the way, but mm. happy almost birthday, Gwee. 
<laughs> Thank well, you. All, I mean, I know I know Icky's and, birthday is next month, and ironically, his birthday is like literally I, like right around the corner from mine. I I I still am so sorry I could never get you the Aloy figure. It's okay. It's those, Cir circumstances you happened. Know what? Yeah. Everybody levels up. I did. I Sorry, Ooh, I did. I got, she is a huge fan of. Uh, so we obviously Horizon huge fan, Zero Dawn. Yeah, Horizon Zero Dawn. Yeah. I bought her an Aloy figure last year. Nice. But that those assholes that I was part of the program for pretty Die. much just stole a lot of my stuff Good when star. I left the program. And one of the and things they stole was the Aloy figure. Yeah. So stupid. And we stole back the Cobalt shard. I just don't know what he would want with that. Anyway, we got no, a no, Cobalt shard. So now we have. Three... They took all the stuff out of my apartment when Whoa, I went. What oh, the, what the hell? hell? Sh so, um, yoink! What's this happening? Is so yeah, mystifying. <laughs> yeah, ba uh, have... Baby Bowser isn't quite happy that we stole his other star Cobalt star like, tree. Oh, devil damn it! Oh, oh. How did that happen? He Whoops. swiped them. Sure. <laughs> Losers! How? Thought you could get away with stealing my treasure from my castle, did ya? Fair. Uh, it's, yeah. a fair cop. it's payback time. I'll take my treasure, plus whatever you just picked up as compensation. Double damage. Nuts. Oh, hey, Kamek. Prince Bowser, let's scram! Yeah, you thought the, you thought these two would have an alliance. Bad chance. Yeah. He's still a brat. Nuts. I'm the one who raised right. it, dickhead. Oh, oh. Cruel fate. We finally succeed in recovering the second shard, and now this happens. So much yeah, way to go. Yeah, way to go. Shame, in the shame cycle initiated. We must return to our own time and rework our strategy. Yeah, I'm like, yeah, back up. Yeah, great interference job there, Stuffwell. <laughs> Could have like maybe well, butted in a me little to do? bit. I don't have hands. All He's I know how to do wrong. is talk and talk what do you think I, and talk. What do you think I have? What do you think I have? Gatling guns on my butt? <laughs> I'm no uh, astro boy. I don't even have point. a butt. Do I? <laughs> do I? He, oh, he has a bottom God. shelf. That's true. Uh, ha, I do ha. have my hinges. Do those count? Yeah. Anyway, right, let's go tell you yeah, that we failed again. Anyway, just going to say I. So yeah, I was part of a program that was supposed to. Um, I think I mentioned it before. That is supposed to mm -hmm. help me ease into uh, ease into being an adult. Yeah, no, the people who ran it were fucking assholes who would lie and basically manipulate me, and they put me in the fucking slavery for a month. It's Pretty much. so weird. It was horrible. All right, but when let's I, go talk to you. Get oh. when I left oh, the hey. pro when I left the program, uh, they they ha there was stuff in my apartment that they just took. And they put in the storage. Oh, that's right. I'm going back here. They for a second. put in. They put it into storage. Just and... grab that. Never mind. No, you oh, can just keep going. He's that. Just what we're, we're just doing, doing a commentary right. here. Don't okay. don't worry, dude. I'm just grabbing some beans. Just they put stuff in the storage for me, uh, or like when I came back, but they didn't tell. But they didn't put it all in the same storage. Nor do they did they tell me where all of my stuff was, and they still haven't told me. And I am not going to deal with the fucking asshole who runs the program again. Which is fair. You know what? Like, I I don't know which one of us joked about it, but I do... Yeah, again, not to belittle your situation, but I'm still amused by the fact that maybe the guy saw the figure you bought. It's like, I could use this for my collection. No. No. No, he wouldn't. He has no idea about he that. Anyway, gotta level up more yeah, back up. I, yeah, in, in all seriousness, the, the the those guys are probably the, just their organization is so lazy and just like, you know, they nice. they just they it's it sounds like to me they they just they're just using extortion to get what they want. You know, they Pretty don't, they much. don't care about they don't they don't care about what you own. They just they they just want to get money from you. Pretty much. And, or, oh, or, and that's... or have you worked for them? Like they did yeah. with me. Hell, actually, yeah. they, they, here's actually one little bit that kind of proves they are into some shady shit, in my opinion. Uh, one, I gave them $500 for my rent one time. And I got a note a week later saying that I didn't pay my rent. And, they, and, I, was, and I paid them to... 
for them to go through and pay use that money that I paid them with for my rent. So why was I getting a note saying that I didn't pay my rent? So what happened? Uh, so before we get back to what we're doing, because we were about to talk to Egad, uh, after that situation happened, did you have to re repay the rent? No, they, like, after I called them out on that, they're like, okay, fine, we'll pay the rent. Basically, some uh, shit like that. It, there, so there I was a second party yeah. involved? Or a third party involved? Oh. I don't know. No, it was something else. I feel like we should just, I, I feel like this is just gonna... Yeah, it's yeah, very, I mean, yeah. This is this a is a subject. this is a very long subject to get into. And also, oh, I know. Too, I'm also a bit personal for this channel. Yeah, no. All, Probably. all I'm going it's to say, all I'm going to say, is that long story short, they're shady assholes who manipulated all the people that jo that joined that program. Specifically, yeah, the two people who ran the program. Okay. Are and what was that, James? All I was gonna say is that hopefully, hopefully it won't be too long before they get themselves fired. At and some point, just, they're, gonna, they're gonna fall apart. And Go I was just gonna say that story is a good testament as to why nine times out of ten, I usually just hand to make way birthday gifts. <laughs> well, you know, it's, it, it is what it is. Anyway, going back to the game real quick, I'm actually surprised that Logan's going out of his way to get every single bean in the premises. Well, like, I... I'll say I'll, I'll say why I'm getting the beans. They're actually quite important. Well, in a in an optional sense, yes. Yeah. For now, we're just gonna move around here a bit, see if I can find some. They're important, there. except they're not. Well, let's <laughs> just have... let's let's just say it's 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 um it's um it's importance is about as much so as um is the um, star bean side quest in Superstar Saga. Though I'd argue it's a little more looser here, where it's a little easier to um actually manipulate. Just gonna say right now, as opposed to the star beans where you're using it to make little coffee thingies that become other different things, this one actually is just an entirely different shop. It acts, and you can buy cool stuff with the beans as a special currency. And the best part That's is there's no, go for. there's only one bean type to worry about. Preferred yeah, there's just essentially another another score of coins. Let's get those for Baby Luigi or Baby Mario. Oh yeah, <laughs> yeah I should probably, I probably should pop, I probably should give them both. There we go. There you go. The preferred yeah. pants for the babies. It's just a fun name though, preferred pants. And, and I just, the branded and slacks. I, and again, I love the idea that this man, that this that that's Toad, the freaking Toad who owes Mario its life, that it's not a freaking block hovering in the air any longer, is well, hey, has to be. Keep our, we gotta keep our economy here strong somehow, right? No, but I was saying, but I was saying, I, but I was saying, I love how they're trying to be a shrewd salesman until they see Mario stash and they're like, whoa, <laughs> okay, eighty percent off. <laughs> what? <laughs> yeah, it's like I'm gonna have to charge you. It's free. <laughs> it just looks. Like you know, I wonder if that's. A, I wonder if that's also the same reason the Mario Brothers don't have to worry about paying rent. That's probably how they, they just, just say. They groom themselves so much, people notice, and they're like, "Oh yeah, I'm definitely giving you a discount." And also, considering, 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 how, considering how much time Luigi has around the house, he spends all that time grooming just so he can he can have he can just have straight up free housing. And they just and groom their mustaches. Go ahead. Sorry. Let's be honest, though. Luigi has the better stash. Yeah, well, I like oh, it. No, 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 no. He has the very kept stash. It doesn't have well, any, like, truths. Well, it's, it's, funny, it's funny you bring that up, Wee, because um, by default, Luigi Ooh. always has the always starts off with a better stash ratio than Mario in yeah. the uh, RPGs. Yeah, that's, that's what I'm referring to. Well, I just, and like, also I just, because, just like, from a from an appearance standpoint, his, his mustache has always been more... S smoother. Okay, got yeah. some ice flowers. Ice flowers are cool in that they function just like normal fl fire flowers, except they can also deal uh, random stamina... Uh, ra stamina. Random status yeah. debuffs. Random ice status are, debuffs. Honestly, I, ice flowers are really just something I only use on the very rare occasion. I use them sometimes if I want to do a lot. If I if I have a bunch of boss characters, I want to deal a lot of damage to. Like, because you can get if you get a defense, if you get a defense down right before a cannonballer. Oh, there's so much more. <laughs> yeah. That's so with that said, before we go talk to you guys to get our next assignment, we're gonna save. We're gonna end the part here, everybody. So thank you all so much for joining in for another ex riveting uh, experience with uh, you time. You done blue get us again. <laughs> yeah, possibly. But what? Did. Blue Gad, it's a whole thing. Join us in the next party, Gadders. Till next time. Bye bye, guys. Bye.